How's it going, everyone? I'm Nostalgic Dave, and welcome back to Nino Kuni Wrath of the White Witch. So, to start this video, I'm actually gonna go off and collect some water. Yeah, a lot of fun, isn't it? <laughs> I don't know if there's anything else I can collect. That is not water, but I do need those. Um. Hmm. Well, let's go over here. Okay, you wanna fight? Fine. Come here. Come here. Come here. Uh, have I found one of these yet? Watch this. All right, time to attack the. No, do not put me. Uh. Well, that was an easy win. <laughs> That's what I like about Nino Kuni. They make it so easy to beat. Like it's not hard. It's easy going and it's fun. But I'm not a reviewer. This has been out for a while. If I was a reviewer, I would have done this a while ago. That should be like the third spring water. Anyway, I just wanted to grab those two, but before I actually heading in, Mr. Bird, you wanna come here? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Creepy. Watch this. I'm watching. Ow. Bruh. Not permitted. <laughs> hey, don't start rubbing your brow now, bruh. It's not time for that yet. Okay, so we're at a level 5, and it looks like we are, it would take us a while to actually level up. Not that I was trying to do that, but it would be kind of nice to see. Anyway, let's go ahead and go help this guy at Ding Dong Dell. Alright, so if I remember correctly... We have like he's still the worse for wear, huh? Unfortunately. We have to help him. Yeah. <laughs> boy, I better explain how it's done then, innit? First thing you'll need to do is to take the locket Tree Face gave you and fill it with the piece of heart our friend is missing. So piece of heart? That's right. One of the bits we're all made up of deep down. The bits we're made up of? So, so we're doing surgery. Just give it a go, you'll soon work it out, man. First off, what that guard's missing is a drop of good old fashioned enthusiasm. Find some and give it to him, and he'll be right as rain. Bruh, I told you before, he just looks tired. Where do I find enthusiasm? Well, now, feast your eyes on that other guard there. He's got more get up and go than a sack of squirrels. If he hasn't got some enthusiasm to spare, I'm a monkey's uncle. Ask nicely, and I'm sure he'll be. How much caffeine? Sure. I'll try my best. How much caffeine does that guy have in him? Hey, you! What are you drinking? Can I have some? <laughs> Maybe it's Red Bull? Uh, excuse me, sir. I wonder if you could do us a favor. I wish I could. I really do. But I'm afraid I can't open this gate without my colleague's permission. Oh, no, it's not that. We just want to borrow some of your enthusiasm. <laughs> well, if it's enthusiasm you're after, I've got plenty to spare. Take as much as you want. Thank you, sir. Uh, Mr. Drippy... How do I get the enthusiasm out of his heart? Um, look at the page old tree face gave you for your book, ain't it? It's a spell called Take Hot. Okay, I don't have the voices right now. Voices are not my... <sighs> take Hot, huh? This one. Hmm, doesn't take any MP either. I bet it took like one or two. I guess it's because it's tutorial stuff. Tidy. Looks like you've got yourself a locket full of enthusiasm. Now, you just got to give it to our friend over by there. Okay, here goes. Yeah, okay. So, um, you. So we need to give this guard the enthusiasm we got from his friend, huh? That's right, Ollie boy. This is about you need to give his give heart now. Yeah, I know. I know it sounds just like the other one. But don't get them mixed up with you two. <laughs> yeah, that would be bad. When you cast Kim Hart. Yeah, I know. Stop giving me tutorials for the love of Pete. Alright. Here, I have a Pop-Tart. I'm, I'm sure it'll help. This Pop-Tart's gives total enthusiasm. Oh my goodness. Uh, 
I think my pop tart gave him a headache. <laughs> Where am I? Oh wait, no, that wasn't a pop tart. Well, well, that was well. uh... back with us, I see. Yeah. Yes, I feel so strange, as if a weight has been lifted from my heart. I feel better. I'm pretty sure I put something on your heart. Goodness for that, I was worried about you. I'm sorry, I wasn't myself. But I'm back now. And um. I'm ready to work harder than ever. Well then, these fine people have all come to visit our great kingdom. I think we'd better let them in. Indeed, Please. Dad. This way, everybody. Can I finally go sleep in a cat museum? <laughs> Wait, what? I can't thank you enough, but I'm sure you'll receive your fair share of merit stamp. <laughs> a cat museum. Yeah, didn't you know there's a cat museum in this town? Actually, it wouldn't surprise anyone, but still. Merit stamps? I'm not doing the tutorial talk. Shut up. Tidy, we can finally go inside. Uh, why you look shocked, Oliver? Alright, can we go visit- Hey, Mr. Drippy, can I go visit the cat museum now? Please? We're finally here. We're finally in Ding Dong Dell. Indeed we are, Oliver. There were a few unseen snags on the way, I'll admit. But all's well that ends well. And I was going to take you to see your tree face eventually anyway. Happened sooner than later, which I'm fine with. Righto. On with the wand hunt. The king of this place knows a spell or two. Let's see if he can help us, shall we? A real life king? Sure. Yeah. He's a statue and he lives over in the museum. Mr. Drippy, please, I just want to go to a museum. Aww. Okay. Wait, I saw that. I want that. Five guilders, okay, I'll take it. Jesus. It's so different. Stop staring, man, it's you. And I, uh, bro, bro. Are you blind? You were the goofy one round these parts. Yeah. Well, I mean, if you. Well, um, but that's isn't that where I want to go? I, I, well, I said museum, but I meant zoo. The cats don't belong in a museum; they belong in a zoo. So shouldn't I be going to a zoo? Come on, let's go to a zoo, Drippy. Come on. It'd be a lot of fun. Fine. I'm sorry, Ollie boy, but no matter how trendy they are in over in Motherville, your clothes are just plain out of place over by here. Are they really so strange? But this is all I have. Then we'll just have to buy you some more, won't we? There's loads of shops here in Dignong Delmon. One of them must sell clothes, ain't it? I guess. Okay, let's go find a store where I can buy. Okay. It's right there! It is literally right in front of you, dude. Hi. Excuse me, ma'am. Do you sell clothes from this world? Uh, I mean, do you sell regular clothes? Clothes, dear? Oh, <laughs> I'm afraid we don't have any in stock at the moment. Don't tell us, about Mon. Have you seen how the boy's dressed? He's a flippin' embarrassment. Hey! He's getting funny looks wherever we go. My street cred is in ruins. Oh, fairy. I used to see your kind all the time. But I'll bet children these days don't even know who you are. You're telling me? Kids these days, Mon. Disrespectful, ignorant, downright rude. Hey! They wouldn't know a fairy if it kicks them in the ass. <laughs> That's what you should have said. Technically, it says flipping chins. Not like you, eh, missus? Now, about these clothes. Yes, dear. Let me think now. Ah! 
Now I come to think of it, there was a traveler who left a set of clothes here once upon a time. He'd bought a new outfit, you see, so he left his old one behind. Roughly human-shaped, is it? And cheap? I shouldn't doubt it. Tidy, we'll take it. Mr. Trippy? Yes, yes, now I remember. He was the one who... Yes, he said they were very special clothes, made from fabric woven for the fibers of the sky tree, if I remember rightly. What? Lovely and comfy. This is hurting my brain. Can we just please shut up? Look, I just want to go to a freaking museum or a zoo or some kind of attraction. I just want to see things in place so I can just reach out and touch it. That's all, <laughs> that's all I wanted to do this whole time. I just wanted to reach out and touch things. I think the only problem would be the size. If it's you who are going to wear this outfit, dear, I'll need a few hours to make some alterations. It would look huge on you otherwise. Could you come back tomorrow morning? Of course we can, Mum. How's about that then, Ollie boy? That is lucky. You know, thank you very much, ma'am. <laughs> a pleasure, my dear. Toodle hoo for now. Until tomorrow. Okay. Tomorrow's flipping ages away, Mum. I'd like to go see the king right away. Like, but we can't go till you've got your outfit sorted out. It? I guess not. What will we do until tomorrow? Are you people ignoring me? I said let's go to a flippin' zoo! Or, or a museum. Whichever one we find first. This place is huge! Ah, oh, great. Now she's getting me to do that. This place is gigantic. All I'm asking is to go to a freaking zoo. I just want to reach out, pat the donkey, and then run away. Before somebody catches me, otherwise I'd probably get in trouble. <laughs> I know. That guard on the gate said something about us getting some kind of cart from a place in town, ain't it? Some... Oh, so it's illusions. The one we just went in. The boutique. That's the owl one. Was it, uh, Swift Solutions? That's clever of you. That's the one. I knew it was some other kind of bird. Nice one, Ollie boy. The stores here sure have do have ugh. stores here do sure have goofy names. Do you reckon? They're just named off after what they look like, ain't it? Anyway, let's get over to Switch Solutions, shall we? I feel like that would be a common thing at some point in time, IRL. Alright, we're gonna go to Switch Or we're gonna run into the river. You know, if we were allowed to. Hello? Hiya. Howdy! Welcome to Swiss Solutions, where those in need come to watch their worries fly away. And where those who are feeling helpful agree to perform tasks on their behalf, which we are going to do all of, and it's going to suck for some of them. What sort of tasks do you mean, sir? You honestly don't know? Dear me, you really are new to this, aren't you? Have you ever seen me before? Well, I shall swallow my amazement and explain. No, you won't. You'll shut up and give me the card. Or I will pet you on the head! My journey, huh? Okay, I think I got it. Did I just say journey? I'm pretty sure that's a journal. The journal will also show you how... Okay, I know! Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. The zookeeper don't, totally won't come get me and try to kick me out. <laughs> okay. Now that that's accessible, that pretty much makes the entire menu accessible. Are there any jobs accessible? Right? Ooh! Ow. Well, we got three errands we can... Wait, are there any chests in here? We have three errands we can run. That's nice. Ah, there's one of them. Hello. Hi. Goodness me. Wherever have those little rascals run off to? 
Is something the matter, ma'am? It's my boys. The three of them are forever running off and not coming back. That's a bit of a problem. Maybe they just went to visit the lion's cage. You don't know. <laughs> I know they're just playing, but I can't help but think they'll hurt themselves. You worry about them a lot, huh? Well, she is their mom. Yes, I do. And today, they're even later than ever. I'm beside myself. Ah, uh, mother's life is never easy. No matter where you will go, eh? You don't have a spare moment. Yes, I do, actually. I will love to do that for you. I'm sorry to put you in... St oh, yes, because it's going to be so troublesome to find three boys. Actually, you know what? You're right. Thank you. Thank you for the apology. I appreciate it. <laughs> I think there's one up here. Dive's gone and hurt himself. Must be one of those ladies lost boys. You'd better patch him up, eh? Jeepers, that looks pink. Dude! Don't say that in front of the kid! I mean, if you're talking about yourself, fine. But we were able to pet the line and got unscathed. Zookeeper didn't catch us. Yet. Now we gotta go to the museum and start just scratching all the statues. Hopefully nothing bad happens. <laughs> Crikey, Ali boy. Brain like a flippin' seed you've got. You're a wizard, ain't it? You s hey, hold on, I just caught onto that. Wait. Oh my gosh. This kid is a dumbass. Uh, okay, here goes. I'm gonna fix you up, okay? There we go. Uh oh. Hmm? It doesn't hurt anymore. Hooray, I'm all better. Listen, sunshine. Your poor mother's really sick about you, right? Get on home with you. I will, I promise. Thank you for making me better. You, you sure? I'm just gonna look at you from the sky. This is normal. I'm just gonna pet the kid on the head. He's just another, it's just a statue. Dude. You. Really? You're just standing there. It's like. You. you you, you told me you were going to go home and you're not moving. It really is a statue. Alright, let's pet the statue. Da, 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 da. Scratch the statue. Something. I don't know. Chest here. Looks like we'll be... Well, we'll actually... We actually will be coming... I was about to say it looks like we'll be coming back later, but yes, we will. <laughs> I legitimately don't remember where the others are, though. Oh, Hello. Meal? It's still not quite pretty enough. Doing a bit of decorating, is it? Well, I'll always say you can't beat a flower to brighten things up, knowing they do. Okay, Drippy, shut up. How clever of you. I was just thinking about using some flowers, trying to make my doorway prettier. You see? You are. What kind of flowers are you thinking of using? Mm, well... Now, I want something nice and bright, and I'll need some fresh, clean water to give them, too. Makes sense. Yeah, I know you can help me. Can you spare the time, pretty please? Sure. You're a perfect gentleman. Now, I'll need you to bring me two plain sport flowers and two bottles of... Okay. Okay, that's not too bad. Yes, neither can be purchased from the shops. Yes, but I know where I can get them. You know, I have to go outside, though. I just want to stay in the museum and start petting every statue on the head. Maybe scratch a few of them. Like, you're not... Are, are you sure you're not a statue? You're holding still. Can I scratch you? That actually might hurt. You're just like... No! <laughs> the statue starts moving. It's like... Ugh. You start reaching out. No. Okay, I'm done. No, don't worry. They positively twinkle. I dare say you've seen twinkling spots on the ground outside town, haven't you? I know what you're referring to. Hush. I'll go get your things. Shush. Tidy. 
Let's go for go a fortune then, shall we? Thank you very much, you're a pair of perfect little gentlemen. Okay, that guy's not accessible yet. I know why. Alright, here's the other kid. Hello. Oh, I tripped over and hurt my leg. Gee, are you okay? Hold still just a sec, I'll fix you right up. I'll just barely have enough MP for this. Wow, doesn't hurt at all now. That's amazing, are you a wizard? Yep. I sure am. Your mommy sent me to find you. She's worried about you. Really? All right, I'll go straight home then. Thank you for doing magic on me. So if I were to throw a fireball on you, you'd be okay. I should try that next time. They're all statues here. Maybe if I throw a fireball at a statue, it'll heal the statue. I'm not particularly certain how that works, but, you know, I, I'm sure it works. Dude. I actually don't... Are there three or four of them? Hold on, I need to double check this. Yeah, okay, there's one more. I know exactly where he is. If he's not over here. I don't think he is. No, 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 he's not over here. I remember where he is. Good grief! Wow, all y'all are slow as all punk out. I'm not particularly certain what that means. I don't know. Hiya. Meal? Which pot did I put them in? Is everything okay? Well, it's my precious treasure, you see. I can't remember which pot I hid it in. Gee, that's tough. What sort of treasure is it? My grandmother's red earring. Such a pretty color. Rubies are pretty, I'll admit that. Yes. I'm just gonna say yes to everyone. It's in one of those pots, you see. I know exactly which pot it's in, don't worry. You're a perfect gentleman. All right, now time to go pretty much bang my fist against one of the statues in the museum. Like that one. That's exactly the one I want to bang my fist again. Against. Same difference. I can't reach it. Let me punch that! Ugh. Rude. That was very rude indeed. See? Knew exactly where it was. <laughs> then again, I played and beaten this game before. I've never 100%ed the game, I'll admit that. This playthrough will be the first time I've ever done that. And 100%, yes, as I said in a previous episode, I don't remember whether it was the last episode or not, but it does include post-game stuff, and I have no idea how to do that. Hi, found you. I fell over and grazed my knee. Ow! Hey now, don't cry. Let me fix you up. Just enough. Huh? It's not hurting anymore. That's right. All better. That's marvelous. Your mother's worried sick about you. Run along home now. There's a good lad. I will. I promise. Thank you very much. Yeah, you're welcome. Statue. You say you're gonna go home, but you don't move. That's ridiculous. Is there anything around here I can pick up? Oh, hello. Eh? What's up with you, Mum? Look a bit pale, you do? Huh? You're giving this to me? Spirit medium. Okay. Well, fancy that. That's a page from the Wizard's Companion, that is. What's this little squirt doing with it? I'm sorry, I can't hear you. Do you think he can't he can't speak? Nah, that's not it, man. If I'm not very much mistaken, yep, must be. Huh? Did you figure something out, Mr. Trip? No, he's talking well, actually. I was gonna say no, he's talking to himself. He's probably wanting you to just scratch the statue. Look, it's holding still. It's just a statue, it ain't moving. Scratch it! Because <laughs> that's what I do to anything that just doesn't move. 
Yep. All right then. Well, but I need more mat. I need more MP. Do I have any MP items? No. Uh, we'll come back to you later. Dang it! That sucks. We'll be coming back to that anyway, just because I'm pretty sure we have to. Pretty sure one of the things we have to do is we have to actually... Ooh, pots! Can I take you home? I know you're part of a museum, but I kind of want to carry this thing around on my head. I want to act like I'm from the olden days. Hi. Yo, my! You've got it! You've got my earring. Oh, that's perfect! Just perfect! You found it for me. You sure did. Don't lose it again now, okay? I promise I'll never lose it again. Oh, here, this is a present for you. Thank you so much. Ooh. You received two merit stamps. Yay! Well, that was pointless. That was outright pointless! For right now. It'll have point later on, but for right now, it was outright pointless. So what is it that I need to grab? Uh, fetch two planes. Oh, I needed to grab a planes or flower. I think we've been in here long enough to where I can actually go out, grab one, bring it back, and then be done with that task. Let's go! I know in there is progression. I'm intentionally not going in there yet. Ooh, statue! I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna pet you. I'm just... No one look. No one sees me. You don't know it, but I'm just scratching the guy. He's not moving, but all you see is... You don't see it, but this is what's going on. <laughs> Alright, I'm done. I'm sure that left a mark. Yeah, no kidding! And he, he, somebody goes up to them and thinks in their statue and just starts scratching. They're gonna be like, what the hell? Stop it! Hey, y'all. Okay, you want to fight me? Fine. Okay, well, that's done and done. Let's grab this and head back. That was a lot of fun. But I kind of missed the museum. Drippy, when are we going to go? Drippy's just like, you were just there, man. They would have kicked you out anyway. I'm just like... Aww, I just want to dance at a museum. I want to get on top of some of the counter things. Just pull my shirt off and just <laughs> be one of those weirdos. No one can stop me, right? Drippy's just like, <sighs> Mon, what is wrong with you, Mon? I'm just like, nothing. I'm just a goofball. Uh, no, Mon. You're something much more than that. Ain't it? Hi. Yo, oh my! You found it already? Yes, ma'am. Are these the things you were looking for? Oh, yes, perfect! Just perfect! I'm ever so grateful, dear. Here, a little present to say thank you. Now that I can use! And there you go. My defense is up! All right, this way. And hello there, ma'am. Thank you so much for finding all three of my boys. Y you're welcome. And you patched the little rascals up as well. They're a treasure, an absolute treasure. I'm just glad we could help. Oh, I can't wait until they grow up a little calm. Oh my goodness. Here, say thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. 
That's a sweet mom. Yay! Drippy, I think these are these are tickets to freaking Nino World. Drippy's just like, the hell? You gone off your lid, look. No. Maybe. <laughs> are there any other side quests I can do right now? That was not the right bag. That wasn't supposed to be a bag. Of, yeah, okay, that's all we can do right now. It is a little bit weird how you can receive them out of order. That is a little bit weird. I'm going to say that. Ugh, fine. Hey, this one's a statue. Maybe I can kick it. Eh, 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 eh. Drippy's just like, Mom, stop it. That's annoying. No, it's not. It's fun. Drippy's like, ugh, what the hell am I putting up with? Is there a chest in, a chest in here? No, but there's this. Okay, I'll take it. Hi. Hi. Welcome to one of the cat's cradle chain of premium ends. We pride ourselves in our practicality and pricing. Okay, jeez. That's a lot of purring. Alright. Your custom is always appreciated. Mule, you look a little unusual. You're a traveler, I presume. And I encourage you to take a nap at each of our ends, wherever your travels may take you. We are very proud of our deep and comfortable beds, and we hope you enjoy them as much as we do. Thank you very much. Eh? Look at your wizard's companion. There's something different about it. Ah, oh, that is useful. The memories of all the travelers who stay here have filled it back up again. Oh my goodness. Gee, I never expected that. I did, actually. <laughs> Why the heck not, Mom? It's a flipping mighty spellbook, ain't it? We'd best stay at as many of these places as we can, eh? I guess so, huh? I mean, you don't have to worry about that. I'm gonna stay at every single one of them. Retain the new regions of the world page. Okay. Alright, time to go to the next museum. Drippy's just like, flippin' heck, man. They already kicked you out of the last one. Do you think I'm really gonna take you to another? I'm like, aww. Hi, Alice. No, you transformed into an eight-year-old. I think you were like 12. And when you do, you'll learn the truth. Promise me, no matter how hard it is. Finn? Mom, who's him? Really? Mom, what do you mean? Who's him? He's someone very important to both of us. But who is he? And where do I have to go? Oh my gosh. We're already going anyway, dude. Don't give up, Oliver. No matter how hard it gets. Mom? Mom! Okay, that's Mom! not act that. That's not normal. This is obviously a dream. Hi. Morning, young man. And what a practically fine morning it is, too. You slept well, I hope. Excellent. You will be on your way now, I expect. Well, if you happen to cross another cat's cradle on your travels, be sure to stay with us again. Tom, missus. See you soon. Righto, Ollie boy. Oh, goodness. Righto, Ollie boy. Back to the house shop, ain't it? Uh, okay. Oh. No, I'll do that later. You people are very pers I'm so used to freaking being able to... Oh, gosh. Alright, we'll go to the owl shop and then stop for the day. Hopefully there's nothing new to do, aside from what's obvious. There's nothing around. Mr. Drippy, what happened? You scared them all off, Mom. You started scratching them, and they don't want to be near you now, Mom. Oh, but I was just trying to poke fun. That's not poking fun. I take that back. <laughs> there you are, dearie. You'll be happy to hear your clothes already. Tidy. 
Best try them on then, Ollie, but Sure. I'll just pop and get them for you, dear. Wait there. I shan't be a moment. Yes, ma'am. Thank you very much. What do you think? Huh? Oh, that's trendy. You look proper sharp, Ollie boy. Trendy? Um, sure. I mean, we are living in the medieval times, so I guess that makes sense, but... What? Isn't it a little... Oh, that's not you. Isn't it a little... Goofy? I asked... I mean, a okay? cape? Don't be silly, dear. It hoots you down to the ground. Thank you very much, ma'am. How much do we owe you? Who? For those little things? Don't be silly, dear. You'd be doing me a huge favor to just get them off my hands. Really? You're sure? <laughs> I can't remember the last time I did any sewing. It was an absolute hoot, dear. Think nothing of it. All I ask is that you pop back and buy some- Oh, trust me, that's gonna happen a lot in this playthrough. You don't have to worry about that one. Of course we'll- Thanks, missus. That's lucky, Ollie boy. Looks like we owe this place another visitor three. Now get out! I don't need my customers fearing you because you're in here. Whoa! 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 Okay, gee, fine, I'll get. I won't scratch anybody anymore, jeez. I legit thought they were statues. G -g totally, yeah, that's totally true. And now you've got some dapper duds. You can head up to the palace, tidy. Time to go meet the king, huh? I'm kind of nervous. I mean, you would be. Okay, there's nothing I can get in here. All right. So we have to head up to the palace next, which is fine and dandy. Um, I just want to double check something really quick. Are there any more uh, side quests that kind of pop up after this, or are we gonna have to wait till after? I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm checking for side quests. That's what I'm doing. Ow, my head. Are there anything new, or is it just the same old? Yeah, they're not now. Okay, well, I guess that's gonna end us for this video. That was. Ugh. I guess I better prep myself to go see the king. I'm not prepped for it yet. Tear. <laughs> for right now, I am going to leave this video here. So, thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Nino Kuni Wrath of the White Witch Remaster. If you liked it, push that like button and so far you can't see it anymore. If you really liked it, consider subscribing to the channel. Have a suggestion for a uh, game either by Level 5 or Bandai Namco that you'd like to see on here? Let me know in the comments below. Want to check out um, RPG, one of those kind of games, that, you know, wherever like that. that that I've done prior to this one, all the links one across my head here. This particular game will be in the top right hand corner. In the meantime, I'm gonna head off, but I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye! Conductor, move the train!